what's up? Today it's time for another minifigure showcase. Um, this time it's about those two Clone Army Custom minifigures. And I guess let's start with the Phase 1 version. Okay, so move some of the parts around. Okay, and there we go. Um, this is a clone custom made, I believe, maybe one and a half or two years ago. I'm not quite sure. And it's based on custom schematics or a custom design, I should say, that I made some time ago. I will put some reference pictures, like maybe here or around here. And um, yeah, back printing is easier to show you on the other one in just a second. And for reference, this one is pretty much the commander fill that we've seen in the Clone Wars TV series, just in blue. From this point on, when I actually got this, I modified the template I had and now it looks like the one I'm gonna put in here and um, I'm hopefully gonna get this one made soon as well. Um, it's currently a little hard to get in contact but hopefully that can be solved. Um, I don't know if you can see it on the helmet but you might be able to, oh well, you can see it 100% on the um, shoulder cloth, not that great, but on the um, waist cloth, I guess, or pauldron. Um, the sun took like 90% of the color out of it and it's pretty sad, so I already replaced the shoulder cloth once or twice because if you have them in the sunlight or in direct sun the decals and um, well printed stuff that you've printed with the standard home printer will sadly remove itself I guess and um, yeah the helmet decals are slightly purplish at the moment and are not that blue anymore so let's get up a few close-ups it's based on the standard Clone Wars um, templates and everything that he always had standard arms and now for the helmet Yeah, I guess you might be able to see it, that it's not the perfect blue anymore. So what I did is I just bought one of his new Phase 1 helmets, put some work into it and added a few of the magic foils <laughs> I have laying around. And um, it's not perfect but it gets the job done for the moment. It's somewhat of the same kind of blue. If it's focusing, there we go. Um, works, as I said, for now, but hopefully it's not a permanent solution. But yeah, let's continue with the phase one, and uh, phase two version, sorry. Okay, so this one's the, the phase two version. Um, there we go. It just has the standard face two um, face plate as well as helmet that Clone Army Custom um, sells on pretty much every face two figure. There you go. And once again, the colors faded towards purple. Not that great. This one, I believe, is the first or second portrait and this one is pretty much 99% in like a small box 
and it ha almost has no sunlight so yeah and it still fades out this one has the well i'm gonna show you up closer um episode three or phase two armor printed all around focus there we go same arms and same legs except for the well, connection piece i guess this one is um customized so that it um well joins up with the printings on this one or it fits perfectly as i said pretty much the same arms or arm printing and um, yeah back printing nothing too fancy just the blue belt and um, yeah for the helmet pretty much the same as the other one i originally wanted to get the t visor but decided against it and um, yeah so this is the current way I have them displayed and this one hopefully as I said gets updated if I get the chance to purchase a few of his well I guess I could call them Clonami uh, Clown Customs Customs <laughs> then um, I might make a small squad for it or for this one right here and he might be in the next the big mock but for this i have to wait for battlefront 2 um, map information to release so until then have a nice day and stay tuned for more clone army customs showcase videos Thank you.